This is your ammo can. This is my ammo can. Let's check it out. The Ammo Can 18 from Liberty. This magnificent beast is giving us a new option. We don't have to shove and pack and cram all of our ammo with our weapons and lose all that valuable space inside of our gun safe. And you don't have to leave it in the closet, under the bed, in the truck, out in the garage, whatever, to the elements or just out, whatever. You can still store it successfully and a lot of it. Let's talk about what you see in front of you. The ammo can stands a magnificent 59 and a half inches tall. Sorry. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay, now it also is 24 and a quarter inches wide. Not super deep. And then from front to back, or should I say from back to front, it's uh, 22 inches deep. That doesn't include the handle or the hinges though, so you need to add a little bit for that. What I'm telling you, leave the numbers on the screen. What I'm telling you is that it's only 22 inches deep, so it's gonna slide into whatever closet you wanna put it in if that's what you want. And I'm telling you that at 24 and a, what I say, quarter inches wide, it's not gonna take up a ton of space. That's a smaller footprint. Okay, take all the numbers off, thank you. So what's cool about that is that we've got a nice box size wise, but not a huge box. And now we put up all of our ammo. The thing is made out of 14 gauge steel. That is what you would find from some of your entry level gun safes, right? That's kind of that beginning point, that starter, excuse me, safe, not super strong. And it's not intended to be by any stretch of imagination. This is not the ammo can safe. This is the ammo can. Period. It's a storage container. That's what it does. That's what it is. It doesn't use a keypad or a mechanical lock. It uses a tubular key. Tubular, because it's round. Um, it's basically essentially just a, a cam lock. Makes a quarter turn when you turn that key. The handle is just convenient so you can get the door open and closed. The hinges are nice because you can do a full 180 so you can get into this thing to get your stuff in and out. Uh, 14 gauge steel, that measurement thing only weighs 270 pounds. Not bad. Let's go inside. The finish is called textured black. That's all it comes in. There's no other color option. So don't be like, hey, can I get that in red? Oh, it's a what? ammo can. It comes in one color, it's textured black. There's nothing here. Cool. Blank canvas. Uh, I've had a couple of people point this out to me. It's like, if you really wanted to, then you could attach something here for extra storage for things out of your way. Here's the inside and let's talk about it. There are one, two, three shelves built in. I think they call them their perma shelves and they are rated for 125 pounds per shelf. Not bad. They're not adjustable. You'll see on the B-roll, how you don't see any metal tracks on the inside of the walls or anything. They're built in, and they're, but they're gonna hold 125 pounds. As you can see, I put really normal sized things in here that you probably already have, or you know what I mean? You might throw in there yourself, like these 250 round boxes or this, this is a pack of what, thousand rounds of nine mil? Yes, yes. Uh, I did use the 50 cal boxes so you can see how many you could stack in there. I didn't do it, but check this out. I mean, clearly I can get another one in over there, right? And it holds up to, uh, what I say? 125 pounds per, so it's not like it's lightweight. And yeah, these are legit, uh, because I'll be honest with you, I've never done it myself, so I wanted to. Can you see me? These are actually full of ammunition. Oh, you wanna see it a little closer? Do, 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 do. That's real ammo. No jokes here, kids. I don't play those games. That's uh, a whole bunch of 22. How many? Couldn't tell you. But just to see that I'm not joking, there's no movie magic here. Wait, listen. It's real weight. Check this out. That's about a thousand rounds of 223. So we did this because again, we don't cheat you guys ever. We're here to educate. Let's see if it actually works. Uh, cool thing is, is that a thousand rounds of 223 is only like 26 pounds. So that means we can hold a whole lot more, right? Um, 
but I just wanted to throw them on here so to give you an idea of the size and everything, okay? There's no great crazy spill that I have for you about this. I'm just here to educate you and tell you there's three shelves, they're not adjustable. They hold 125 pounds each. Um, I think it's fascinating that there is the capability in the back, uh, a plug outlet, kind of like they do have in their gun safes. So if you wanted to, you could add the electrical outlet to it so that you could put in a dehumidifier, which I strongly recommend because you spent a lot of money on your ammunition. Let's keep it dry and protected so that you could put a dry rod in here or whatever contraption. And uh, depending on where you put this thing, you've already added power, you could add lights to it. I'm bougie, I might. So with that, uh, you can find those products on our website. Um, before I forget though, let me think. Okay, there are two locking bars though. 3 16th inch steel, move in and out. There are two of those. Okay, I'm not gonna cheat you. It does say that it's made in America. I should always start with that. It's made in America. The steel's from an American company. The shelving, everything, it's American made. Um, 11, I did, 11, 0.7 cubic interior feet, if you're wondering, for you mathematical folk out there. There is no PAL you saw like in the gun safes. There's no oversale here. Ladies, gentlemen, it's an ammo can. It's literally this, all grown up. And it's awesome because it holds a ton of crap. I mean, look at all these boxes. I mean, look at this. We could put a lot of ammunition in here. There are four holes in the bottom so you can anchor down so nobody can take your stuff. I want you to take a second to appreciate this fine t-shirt that I'm wearing today, by the way, if you don't mind. That is our A1 EDU Texas logo. We've got multiple shirts, multiple designs. Mm. You can find those online. Um, with that, oh, I'm sorry. This is not a gun safe. I know I said that. Let me explain. There is no lifetime warranty on fire and burglar protection. You get a five-year manufacturer's warranty on the lock itself though. So if you have an issue with the lock or the keys, whatever, there's five years. Something goes wrong with the paint, like it bubbles or chips or something weird or whatever, that's covered for five years, okay? If you lose your keys, you can call and you can get new keys cut. Or when you buy it, you tell me right off the bat, like, hey man, go ahead and make me a couple extra keys, Robert. I'll go ahead and make you a couple extra keys because I'm a locksmith, that's what I do. Other than that, that's pretty much the ammo can in a nutshell. This guy is, let's think of a price. Cool, I got one. So as of right now, this is February of 2024, and it is $6,000. Put that on the screen. There we go. I said six, I can't, 6,000. Okay, it's 699, sorry. They won't let me change it. $699, you can put all your ammo up. That's a lot of it. I say all of it, don't be cool. I know you have a bunch. Oh, my gun will fit in there. I get it, you're cool, all right. As you can see, we put a whole lot in there though. So again, that's only 2,000 rounds of nine mil. We put a whole lot in there. So after that, you can keep putting more in there. I like it. If you have any questions, like, comment, subscribe, follow along and uh, we'll keep bringing you videos. All right, see you guys on the very next one. Thanks for watching.